Yo, what is up, guys? Darsh2 back in the game on for you guys. And before we get into this video, if you guys are new, make sure to subscribe. The channel really means a lot to me. We are on the road to 100 subs, y'all. Um, thank you for all the love and support and just all the feedback that you guys have been giving me um, throughout my videos. Um, thank you, thank you a lot for that. Um, also, make sure to comment down below what other things, what other you know, videos you guys want me to do. Um, and drop this video a like. Um, and so I am back. The last time I dropped a video, not a stream, but a video was, um, two weeks ago, I'm pretty sure, which was the Sniper Shootout, uh, Apex Legends video. If you have not checked that out, please go check it out. It was really, really, really fun video. Um, but that was, I'm pretty sure that was the last time I uploaded an actual video, but I'm back. Um, I actually had a lot of school stuff going on, but, um, if you guys all know, we're going on to winter break now, so, uh, you know, I'm, um, I'm, I'm, uh, hoping I can get back onto the grind. I'm touching my eye. There's something like, it's like an eyelash or something, I don't know, um, but we're back with another reaction. We're going to be checking out reporters asking NBA players stupid questions. I hate the media. And uh, so do the and so do the NBA players. So let's check it out. This is not copyright. I hope. Please. I think. Please, YouTube. Please don't do this to me. Please don't put a copyright claim. Because I don't think it's a copyright claim. I checked out other videos. Um... I checked out other reaction videos and they didn't have like a copyright thingy in their d description, so I should be good. But let's check it out. Chris, uh, we got Chris Paul first. I need to turn on my audio. Will the Clippers be back here Sunday playing a game seven? Oh, oh, oh yes. Chris, uh, will the Clippers be back here Sunday playing a game seven? What? <laughs> You're feeling about. You know, your level of confidence that you'll be back here again. What you think? For I, I'm on the team. What you want me to say? No, nah, it's open. I, just, I mean, that's what you want to hear? Yes. That's... Come on, man. You've been doing this long enough. Seriously, right? Could you expand upon that? No, nah, I don't know. Everybody in here laughing for a reason. Damn. Bobby on the left side. Bobby Stand. Ramos, bottom line. This is for... My boy D-Wade and LeBron. I miss this. Both of you, you have a great defense. They're averaging 104 points a game. You have a lot of offense. You haven't broke 100 yet. Is the problem your lackluster defense, or is it the problems you're having offensively? Lackluster offense. Problem is we down two games to one. That's the problem. We got to figure out how to tie it up. Um, As a like. LeBron a great father at the Chicago game. What? Yes, he did. Great father. Oh, a great father. father. Oh, I thought he's. Oh, I got. I interpreted that that completely wrong. Okay. I thought you said he was a great father to him. I was like, what? Called him a great father. So, yeah. what type of parental role has he right. played for you and your? Kyrie is the most weirdest NBA player. I'm not talking about his skills. It's just the things that he that he believes in. He believes the earth is flat. Which is completely completely wrong. Um there's some other things too, but I forgot. But he believes in a lot of Oh yeah. Right. He believes that um the first superstar that he has ever played with is now with the Kevin Durant. Boy, you played with LeBron and you got Boy, you played with LeBron and you got, what, two, uh, two, three, no, one championship, I'm pretty sure. Boy, you played with LeBron. He's a superstar, but he said this is the first one I ever played with. Boy, he got you a title, bro. You're, and you s drained that shot. Game seven. Yeah. Oh, okay, so you, t uh, yeah, yeah, I, parental role? Honestly, I'm, I'm, you know, he's, <laughs> I don't know how to really answer that question. I'm, 
he's been a he's been a, a great leader for us. I wouldn't. I have one father. I, that's my dad, Frederick Irving. Um, but for us, in terms yeah, of learning no the nuances of the game and also how to win on the court and also how to carry ourselves off the court, <laughs> yeah, I feel like yeah, he's yeah. been a great influence in, in that role. Okay, uh, Draymond. Uh, here's an interesting question. So last. Bro, okay. This is probably the most stupidest reporter. I, I've actually I've actually seen this before. Um, not this whole video, but uh, um, I I have seen this particular clip before. And Draymond gets so heated. Um, this is the most stupidest reporter I've ever heard ever, ever, ever. Or maybe the guy from ESPN. I don't know. Last year you visit us. Uh... Game three, there's no flood. You win. Game four, there was flood. You, lo you lose. And this year, you visit us. Game three, there's a flood. You win. Game four, there's no flood. You, uh, uh, no, game three, three, there's flood. Bro, nobody cares about no floods, bro. People are losing their lives, cuz. You, you lose. Game four, there's uh, no flood. You win. Brother, so, you, you mean... asked me about the flood in practice the other day. You know, and I, um, I, I said I pray for the city of Houston because you don't want to see anyone go through that. Facts, I feel you? like you keep trying to get at like us hitting threes or something. You're trying to get a controversial statement out of me, but you're not because I feel sorry for the people of Houston. Facts. People are losing their homes, losing their cars, losing their lives, losing loved ones. And you're trying to get a controversial statement out of me about the threes. We're hitting. I know what you're getting at, but you're not getting that out of me. It's It sucks. If I was from Houston, I'd do anything I can to help the city out. And I'm sure some of those guys are going to do what they can to help the city out. And you saw a donation the other, other, the other night. I will say, rain in Texas doesn't sound... Actually, rain in Houston doesn't really fit together. Because I feel like it's... Because it's always hot, cause it's always hot to down south, always. Um, so that would be like Texas and all around, like, to Texas and stuff, so I want to think there would be a lot of rain, but there are floods, bro. It's crazy. It sucks. Stop trying to do that. That's not cool, man. You keep asking me the same question about this flood. These people are losing their lives, bro. Losing their homes. Don't ask me that no more, because it ain't cool, and you're not getting the statement you want right of me. That's not cool, Tell man. Em. Stop Tell doing him, that. Toward Tell the end him. of the game, uh, you shot a three, kind of putting the dagger into him, and you look toward the crowd toward uh, Rihanna. Uh, was was that uh, uh, on purpose, or or do you remember that? Or I don't even remember that. <laughs> uh, well, just to yeah. let you know, social media is buzzing about really? it. Really? Yes. Don't get in that trap. Yeah, bro. don't get in that trap. <laughs> I'm cool. <laughs> Have fun with that. Dan Feldman, NBC Sports. Steph, uh, I'm sorry we keep asking you about squatting, but, well... Draymond and Steve were arguing with the ref and one of them got the technical look like you squatted down and were you just stretching there and what did Richard Jefferson okay this has nothing to do with this video but have you guys heard about two hype mopey if you don't know go check it out like just search up mopey two hype just 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 search up mopey two hype m-o-p-i and then two hype which would be the which would be the the number two and then hype it's crazy Oof. Person say to you, you, you serious be right bro. now? You gotta be better. People, people are curious. Come on now, man. <laughs> this is crazy. You gotta be better than that. <laughs> people are curious. <laughs> I really don't have an answer for that. That's the craziest thing I've ever heard. What, what did Richard Jefferson say to you? I have no idea. I don't remember what what uh, situation you're talking about, but yeah, um, you gotta be better, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. God. I like you, but you gotta be better. <laughs> Kenny, I'll take the compliment. Russ, did you guys lose this game or did the Jazz win this one? We all know this one. Come on. It's a classic. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Alright, we're, we're, we're going to skip a little bit because it has a wrong word. So. <laughs> you may not... Um like this one and i'm not thrilled What's asking and i'm obviously here, okay? trying to What's defuse mean? this a little bit but um it appears that you unfollowed the Cavs on twitter today and it's it's caused quite a stir why did you do that or what what would go into that next question next question um, under, you've had 38 assists tonight that's a season high what can is this something you can take forward to the next game uh i'm i'm i'm, I'm 
I'm done. Mark, last question. LeBron, Mark Schwartz, CSP. Wait, 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 wait. 38 assists and they, wait, did he just, whoa, 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 huh? Who unfollowed the Cavs on Twitter today, and it's, it's caused quite a stir. Why did you do that, or what, what would go into that? <laughs> Next question. Next question. Um, under, you, you've had 38 assists tonight. That's a season high. Well, can, is this something you can take forward to the next game? Uh, 38? Is that what I, I heard? I'm, 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 I'm I done. Know, Mark, last question. LeBron, oh, Mark Schwartz, that. ESPN. From listening to everybody's reaction to the play at the end with JR getting the rebound, there's still confusion about whether JR... This is the dumb piece of crap person that we're talking about. Sorry for calling you. Well, you're you're not a dumb piece of crap. I'm just saying the questions that you ask are stupid. This is the guy, Mark Schwartz, the ESPN. Or thought the game was this is tied, the dude. Or, the way, or whether he thought you guys were ahead. From where you stood on the court and from talking to him after the play, what what's your reaction to it? What's your version? What do you mean, what's my version? Well, did he think that the game was tied, or did he think that you guys had it salted away? How do I know that? Or did you discuss it at all Back with him no, at the end of the play? No. They asked me if I talked to JR about it. I said no already. I knew it was a tie game. We met, we, we was down one. Um, George Hill went up. He made the first one. We got the offensive rebound. You know, I thought we were all aware of what was going on. That's my view. So, I don't know what JR was thinking. I don't know the question that you're trying to ask. I was just trying to see if you, you knew exactly what his state of mind was. Did he think that you guys had it won or did he think he was trying to make a play? Not no. sure. What do you mean I'm not sure? No, I don't know his state of mind. Did you know if he knew the score? Thank you. Bro, Mans walked out with the shades and like the, I don't know what that's called, but he wore like a, a short, short, I guess, a short shorts. I don't know, bro. Man, has his shades on. Kobe, not to twist your words or read too much into what you said, but. Rest in peace, Kobe. I got to say that. Being around young players energized you. That's not a statement about maybe you'd like to see some young players on your team. Wow. That, <laughs> you know what? That's a Bikram yoga stretch. You stretched the hell out of it. Good job. Good job. I'm not even going to answer that. That's just silly. Next. <laughs> Do you think Harden is a max player? Or would you rate him as a shooting guard in the NBA? Um... James Harden is a, is a great player for our team. Uh, he does a lot of great things for us, and um, he's going to continue to do that for us. No Y'all remember when Harden was on the Rockets? That was crazy. No, not Harden on the Rockets. Y'all remember when Harden was on the Thunder, bro? He was young, bro. He didn't even have a beard at that time. I, I said, I said y'all remember Harden on the Rockets. Heat. I've been following you, y'all. Guys, better pull off that Harden trade. Swear. No more questions for you, bro. <laughs> Even though, if you guys don't know, I'm a big Miami Heat fan. But I also am a Bulls fan, but more of a Heat fan. Just wondering if you guys noticed my hoodie and said, why are you saying for the Heat? So. <laughs> more of a Heat fan. <laughs> Heat Nation, very, very big fan. Sorry, I put it up. Defend home court at this point? Uh, well, I mean, are you a smart guy? I think so. I sure. think so, right? So we don't defend home court laps. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. I'm asking you. Well, yeah, then you guys are looking at getting swept. All right. So, the answer to your question. Nah, I'm good. I'm good. Just need some food and some, some wine. I'll be all right. <laughs> How do you think he was handling just the frustration? later in the game of, of, you know, the way he played or didn't play in the first half. And, and, and as things kind of, in, in the fourth quarter, it seems like, you know, he, he wasn't, things weren't breaking for him. What's your question? Well, how, how do you think he handled the frustration? Um, I mean, it seemed like there were a lot, I mean, a lot of things that were yeah, I mean, going against uh, him. 
Well, he's a competitive guy, man. So you felt like he had, they missed a the goal to the call, which they did miss. And, and I said so after the fact. So he kind of lost a bit for a second and went went crazy. You know, he didn't pick up a technical foul or anything like that. But I felt like he played with the intensity that we want him to play with, you know, in the second half. Does that, does that say something, though, that, I mean, you guys scored on the possession anyway and that he's, he's still frustrated enough that he's, uh, you know, not letting it go? <laughs> What are you writing, a temper tantrum column, Andrew Bynum thing? No, no I mean, look, he, 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 everybody has moments where they blow up like Kobe, that. Kobe, get him, Kobe. Kobe, get him, get him. Do I what? Do you still feel the same way about practice? Do I what? Do you still feel the same way about practice? <laughs> Obviously, you didn't get it. <laughs> that is probably Allen Iverson. He a Bulls fan, yo? Why are you wearing so much Bulls? Damn, I don't know if it was going to be a bad word there. I should have. I didn't know that. My bad. Well, 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 I, didn't say that. I didn't know if you wanted to clear anything up. I didn't know what, what video? There's a video that the Thunder Twitter account tweeted out. What video? It's a video of you putting up a shot pregame. Ran off and yelled something. I would something never say no other man's name like that. For one. Not, Thank you, Kyrie. What do I look like? I was talking to my trainer's daughter. His name is her daughter. Her daughter's name is Jamie. Thank you, Jamie. Bro, Westbrook looks so high, bro. I'm going to keep going on there. I'm going to keep my spirit up. Because I'm not about to even involve myself in no dumb stuff like that. But next question, man. Westbrook looked really high, bro. Yeah, he's a good player. He's a good player. Yeah, 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 he's a good second time in three games. Uh, you guys really struggled when Russell went to the bench. You were out there for part of that. What goes on when he goes to the bench? Why is Houston so successful? And, and do you sense that, that they sort of get an energy boost just from him going out of the game? Hold on, see uh, I don't want nobody to try to split us up. We all one team. Regardless, if I go to the bench, if Steve is on the floor, if I'm off the floor, we in this together. Don't split us up. Don't try to split us up. Don't try to make us go against each other. Try to make against Russell so, and the rest of the guys. Westbrook is such a good guy when he just steps up to reporters. And try to like you know backs up his teammates, and when he just doesn't like anything, he just you know he just confronts and he doesn't you know sugarcoat it. So that's really good, you know. He really sticks up for his teammates. That's good. I also like Stephen Adams a lot, but now he's on the pills. Guys, Russell against Houston. I don't want, I don't want to hear that. We in this together. We playing as a team, mm -hmm. and that's all that matters. That's it. Yeah, Russell. I'm not trying to split. Yeah, but. Twice in three games, you guys have not played well at all. When you've gone to the bench, that's fine. We, and say, I'm just say, trying to figure out what's going say, on. Russell, you ain't played well at all. Say Russell and the team is haven't played well. Don't say when Russell goes out, the team don't play well. It don't matter. We in this together. That may that may be Russell, but I asked Stephen a question, well, and it's, it's a legitimate. Me and you. Next question. It's a legitimate question. Next question. Oh, Next question. Well, Next question. No, I think we won't keep the microphone. I had a question for Steve. I had a question for Stephen, and it wasn't answered. And I don't understand if Stephen wants to say he still hasn't said anything. If he wants to say I don't want to answer that, fine. But next question, please. Damn, bro, that reporter is pissed. I think that's the end of the video. And it sure is. Okay, um, this is basically gonna wrap it up for the video, y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed. We on the road to. 100 subscribers y'all um this is a pretty good reaction video um comment down below what other things you guys want me to do other little compilations like these because i don't want to get any copyright anymore please youtube um but yeah it's basically gonna wrap up for the video hope y'all enjoyed be safe stay positive happy holidays until then Darsh tv out